What's up, everyone? It is 9 o'clock. We're going to get started here in a moment. I uh, hope everybody had a great weekend. hope it has finally started to warm up for everybody in the country. Um, it did warm up for me, and then it promptly rained all day Saturday. But that was, that was all right. I got to see some movies. So it all worked out in the end. So uh, we're going to be continuing on with Magic Knight Ray Earth tonight. 
Um, we're about, we're a few hours into it. Uh, I want to say we're probably over halfway. Um, but I don't know for sure. So, you know, we're just going to keep going. It is not a very long game, but uh, we'll just see where we end up. So I'm going to cut over to my live screen. And we'll go ahead and get started. Um, so uh, last time we were, we fell from the, from the bridge. Uh, we saw some people die. It was very heart, heart wrenching. And then we got a mysterious assassin sent after us by Zagat. Uh, who could it be, I wonder? Hmm. Hey, Rin! Uh, I'm here, although I'm super sleepy. Wore myself out with after work swim. So I'll probably, uh, poof out of existence in a little while. No problem. I appreciate you stopping by. Oh, you're strangers, aren't you? I can't believe anyone would want to come here. <laughs> uh, ever since the giant lake monster came, people have stayed away in droves. In fact, most of the villagers thought that still live here are locked up like prisoners in their own homes. Had to come by and witness more rat wacky dialogue. This game delivers that in spades. If nothing else, it delivers the wacky dialogue, other than the fact that it butchers the actual source material. But, you know, it's still fun. <laughs> Late at night, I've been hearing loud thuds. Sounds like footsteps, actually. At first, I thought it was my tubby little honey. And then I realized they sounded bigger than it. What? <laughs> it delivers the... Personally, I think it's the terrible beast that is hiding in the lake. <laughs> Rin says it delivers the skanks. <laughs> oh... So, funny story. Um, I am in t I'm in the process of uploading my recordings to YouTube for uh, just for archival purposes. Because uh, as much as I like Twitch's upload feature, YouTube's is a little bit better, and a lot more people watch pre-recorded stuff on to on YouTube. Um, I got an immediate content fl ID flag, and my uh, first Magic Knight Rare stream got blocked worldwide. And I'm like, what? What happened? And apparently it instant flagged the intro to the game. Like the, the intro and the little the jingle behind it. And we were we were commenting about how uh, how they changed the intro, but it was still fundamentally the same. Yeah, apparently that that got me a content flag. So <laughs> we'll see if that gets overturned. I appealed it, but you never know. <laughs> so Magic Knight Rare Earth may be a Twitch only series. We'll have to see. <laughs> they didn't change it enough. Uh, did you know that there's an actual town up on the flo up on that floating island in the sky? We like to call it the Sky Garden. They say that p the people up there worship the statue of their protector, a giant bird. It's the bird from a stall. Clearly, this is in the future, and the bird is now a god. Uh, there's something strange about the the big lake here. How many lakes do you know of that have a, a patch of land right in the center? Quite a few, actually. Whoa. That was a little weird. 
Uh, a spirit beast dwells in the lake here. Long ago, it took people to the Sky Garden. Well, it's an old story. I can't really say if it's true or not. I bet it's a rune god. I'm gonna guess and say it is a rune god. It's called an island, folks. Not that strange. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I guess this is a museum. See the future in the sphere of truth. All I see is some rust. Is the sphere of truth like eight ball? It says the land of Cifero, Cif or how about not Tokyo, where Umi should be right now. <laughs> I like how Umi just talked in the third person there. <laughs> All right, we need to listen to some of their some of their diaries while I'm thinking about it. Our weapons and our magic combined couldn't even touch Inova. The amount of power he <laughs> showed me, a little afraid. The really scary part is that I know they got as much stronger than Anova. So Rin just asked Eight Ball if it was a sphere of truth and it responded with most likely. <laughs> Inova cannot have a heart in the human sense. He killed his own without even flinching. I think he's pure evil. He's evil! <laughs> This adventure is getting really confusing. <laughs> Thanks, Hikaru. <laughs> Thank you for the <laughs> very informative note. <laughs> uh, I like how our icon's got kitty ears, too. <laughs> uh, keep, keep being innocent, Hikaru. <laughs> Never change. Hikaru, you are useless, says Rin. <laughs> it's a case full of weird rocks. Too bad there's no Escudo among them. It's a big stone pot with weird writing on it. Okay. About the... The Pillar of Cifero, Princess Emerald. Wow, who does her nails? <laughs> uh, okay. Hey, Akaru. <laughs> She's just... Actually, I want to... I want to explore some more. The spirit beast from the lake has everyone scared. But in truth, it hasn't hurt anyone. Well, except for young Nero's mother. But I believe that was an accident. I have a feeling we're going to find out who Nero is. Hopefully it's not the Nero from from Roman times. <laughs> My son Nero is a little too caught up in his vivid imagination. <laughs> he says he wants to grow up to be a magic knight. Like in the legends. What legends? <laughs> I wish I could talk some sense into him. Maybe you girls could give it a try. <laughs> oh, if only he knew. What a nice looking treasure ball this is. And the perfect color, too. That stupid monster, I'm gonna get him if it's the last thing I do. Say, aren't you the legendary magic knights that everyone's been talking about? How did he know? Whoa, can you take me on your, on your student? That way I can get strong enough to gain revenge on the monster that hurt my mom. Aren't you a little young to be so, um, vindictive? <laughs> Hikaru is just a boy. His mother was hurt and he needs to feel empowered. <laughs> uh huh? Um, yeah, what she said, except the part about me being a boy. I'm a man. Uh, not yet, buddy. <laughs> And I'm going to prove it by taking out that worthless monster. Whoa, slow down there, pup. 
<laughs> Why don't you leave the dangerous stuff to us, okay? If you get hurt or killed going up against that monster, your mommy would be would be crushed. You mean like the monster crushed her arm? I'm gonna get that monster no matter what. You just wait and see. Well, we tried. A futile effort. Oh, my ar arm is just killing me. That darn monster made the whole house shake, and a shelf collapsed right on my arm. It's not too serious, but my son Nero is quite concerned about it. <laughs> the way he talked about it, it was like the monster personally walked up and, like, stepped on her arm and laughed at her as, as it did it. But it's like, oh, the house shook. A shell fell. Obviously, it was the monster. He's vowed to get the monster back, no matter what. I hope he doesn't do anything rash. Just... The proof seems inconclusive to me. These folks hate their kid naming him Nero. <laughs> they might. It's very possible. Either that or they don't know. They don't know about Emperor Nero. Uh, let's see. Alright, I think we've done everything there is to do here. So, time to leave. Where's the next house we can break into? Uh, do you know who Zagat is? Uh, no. How about no? Who is he? He's only the next most powerful person in all of Cifero after the princess. Have you been living under a rock or something? Uh, no, we're not from around here. <laughs> uh, best thing in the world would be to find a priest character named Caligula. <laughs> I recently heard about a village out there that keeps monsters away with a magic barrier. I sure wish we had one of those things. Yeah, that didn't work too well. Inadvertently topical. <laughs> okay. Um... Let's see where else we can go. Oh, can we go this way? No. Uh, let's see. I don't like the layout of this town. I just had to run all the way to the other side. Um, late at night, I've been here. Oh, we already talked to this guy. The monster that's been around town at night must have been pretty huge. When it walks around, the ground trembles around it, sometimes violently. A woman in the inn got hurt when the trembling caused the shelf to collapse on her. Fortunately, she survived, but she hurt her arm pretty bad. Nero says he's going to go after the monster at the lake for what it did to his mother. I understand how he feels. But don't you think he's going a little overboard? Uh, maybe just a tad. He'll grow out of it. Maybe. Uh, <laughs> there's a kid named Nero who lives in this village. He's adventurous to say the least. If his mo mother doesn't keep an eye on him, he's gonna become that monster's mi midnight snack. <laughs> The painting of the landscape of Cifra. Okay. We have seen everything. Alright. Next house. You'll never believe what I saw last night. Late at night, a monster emerged from the lake and came to the village. 
I went to get my art kit to paint a picture, but when I came back, it was gone. Isn't that nuts? Maybe it's a collective hallucination. Whoa, here's some monsters. Oh, were you frightened? Don't be scared. They're just life-size dolls. I use them to scare scare off them and annoying zealots who come here come to the door all the time. <laughs> all right. I think that's everybody. So, I think there is nothing less left for us to do but go jump in the water and swim to the island or attempt to anyway is this the island I'm a little disappointed by this island I, I was expecting something a little bit more but okay. Okay. Clearly we can't go that way. At least not yet. Here. Nope. Okay. That's not a path. <laughs> Alright. Ah! Oh. There we go. Have <laughs> uh, we been in here? What do I need? Nope, don't need anything. We're good. So, I must have missed somebody. There must be something I need to talk to. Or someone. Not there. Yeah, I don't like the layout of this town. It's really hard to navigate. Nero's a strong-willed child. Once he got his mind made up about something, well, you know. Perhaps you could keep an eye on him tonight. You're welcome to stay here. Will you spend the night? All right. That's what we That's what we were looking for. Sandy would very much like me to open the treat drawer. Like answering Jehovah's Witnesses in the news. <laughs> uh, uh. Well, that's one way to... To get them to leave. <laughs> Most people just don't answer the door. <laughs> it's Godzilla! Oh, we're being raided. We're being raided by the monster in the game. Hey, Chris. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you to everybody that, that joined as well with Chris. We are playing Magic Knight Ray Earth on the Sega Saturn. No emulation here. We have official hardware. Let's see, have you heard the good word? Well, F is a pretty good word. <laughs> All right, so 
to bring everybody up to speed, we just came into a town and it's got a monster problem. And this kid's uh, on a, uh, a mission to bring the monster down. Uh, listen, did you, did you girls hear that? He's out there again. Nero, come back! Yeah, he's gonna... He's gonna hurt himself. That that kid thinks he's gonna take down a monster. I tend to disagree. Today was rough. What? Uh-oh. What happened today? See, where did Nero run off to? No. Oh. Are you referring to your stream? I thought you were doing fine. All right. All right. Well, we're on the island. I don't see anything. Wah! The island! It's it's moving! We're on a floating island. But how is this that possible? Well, actually, if it's floating, it's obviously not an island, per se. <laughs> the text is going really slow. Whatever it is, greenery somehow grew over top of it, over grew on it over time. Making it appear like one. And that makes me very <laughs> uncomfortable about the ground we're sitting on. Well. Uh-oh. Okay. I thought the game froze on me for a second. <sighs> Play the music! It's a glowy stone that we can't interact with. All right. Uh, what's where? Where does this water lead? Ah! Well, I just killed a butterfly. I'm pretty sure it would have attacked me if I didn't. Whoa, that, that, that was not very nice. Whoa, okay. All right. Not playing around, huh? I see how it is. Whoa, what? Oh, that's a... There's something evil right there. Whoa! No, stay away. Don't come any closer. Whatever you are, bush monster, stay away from me. Whoa! No, whatever you are, you stay away from me too. Okay. Heal. Let's see. Rin went uh, for a swim at the Y right after work and now, <laughs> now slowly dying. No, there is no death allowed on my stream. <laughs> I forgot to take the meat out of the freezer, so now we're going to... Now we have to go get food. <laughs> uh, Grubhub. Huh. 
see. Better than forgetting to put it in the freezer. Yeah, that would not be good. Whoa! Uh-oh. No, you... Uh-oh. Alright, uh, heal. Or Hikaru's gonna die! I don't know what I'm looking for right now. Can I go this way? No. Okay. I thought we found an escape route. We did not. It was a trap all along. Whoa. Okay. Yeah. Oh, what is this? This is neat. Beast, the secret cave is what it says. Will Nero be there? Well, is... Does that mean it's up here? Or no? No. Okay, there is no secret cave up here. Maybe further down? Oh, there's something. Can we get down there? Not from here. Ah! There's too much foliage! And these butterflies! Why are they so evil? way? No. Cannot go that way. Clearly we have to double back. No, 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 no. Ah! No! Okay. Did not work as I had planned. We ended up right where we, we started. We found a health potion. However, we already have one, so we have to leave it. Oh, that's not fair. Alright. Uh, how about here? I think we ended up right where we were the last time. Yeah, we did. Okay. Slowly getting the lay of the land here. Eventually, we will know. I will know where I'm going. Foilage! I love your mouth words, Dees. <laughs> I try to use a uh, a verbose voc vocabulary. Vo uh, vocabulary. Let's see. Oh, here's the cave. Found it. But first... OP Foo! OP Foo! <laughs> Alright, got him! <laughs> Oh, we already have one of those two? Okay. Alright, uh... Whoa! Okay. Alright, those are some evil trees.
Let's see. We're going to go get rolled ice, ice cream and food real quick. BRB. Have fun, Chris. Thanks for stopping by again. Oh, my. Those trees. Return to the waterfalls right. Advance the water waterfalls left. Could it mean to dive into this waterfall? Is that what it means? All right, let's see here. Return to the waterfall's right. Advance the waterfall's left. Okay, I think... Oh, well, first I'm going to do that, apparently. Um, trees get hit by lightning. Blame the trees. It's the trees who are to blame. Open. There we go. A gem. We're rich. Whoa. Okay. I am not looking to mess with you. Whoa, okay, buddy. Settle down. Settle down, doggy. There. Heal! Heal, dog, heal! Okay. I think this is the cave. Oh. At least now we can heal. And save. <laughs> Alright, I'm dead. I'll see you all another day. See you, in. Thanks for stopping by. Ah! Okay. This is not good. Alright. Clear the evil doggies. And we're going to go run back into the cave where it's safe. Uh-oh. If the butterfly doesn't kill me first. Where is the cave? There's the cave. Heal! Alright. Uh, no! Uh-oh. No! Nice! Got all of them. Alright, I think I know what to do here. Yeah, there we go. something here. Yeah! Bust through that rock wall! The Twilight Medallion! I have no idea what that is, but I'm sure it's important. Watching you, tree. <laughs> that dog is gone. All right. Uh, which way to the exit? Oh. 
Oh, we already found that. Yep. Ah! Can't go this way. Alright. Uh, no evil butterfly. You will not lure me into a so uh, false sense of security. I know the evil of your ways. Okay. Alright. We've escaped! We've escaped it! Ugh. Yes. Yes! My intuition was correct. <laughs> oh, 90s anime. I ran. <laughs> the doggy scared me away. I had to escape. Oh. oh we want to go back to the island. Or back to the... The west side. We came from the east side. Now we're on the west side. Oh, wait. We came from the west side. Now we're on the east side. I don't know the direction. <laughs> ah! Uh-oh. Well, Umi died. And there. <sighs> well, that was not what that was not good. Whoa, no, face hugger, get away, get away. a large gem. We're rich. We have 325. Oh, hello. OP bo bow and arrow. this works because it realistically it shouldn't because it's on a higher plane but whatever I'm not going to question it magical arrows Butterfly has been holding out on us. Let's see. Is there a way out? Maybe. Clearly not.
Oh, that was a mistake. Now I gotta fight these guys again. Got him. Uh. The butterfly. I feel like there's got to be something here that I'm missing. But I don't know what. across the bridge. Yep, there's a cave. No spooky monsters. Oh, there's lots of sco spooky monsters. Okay. Uh Let's see. We got to use our got to use our item or I'm going to die. There we go. Uh-oh. <sighs> Those things hurt a lot. Oh, welcome back, Chris. PB and J, the old reliable. We got our health potion back. All right, let's see. Whoa, there's a face hugger. Stay away. A dead face hugger. Let's see. Uh, we are lost in the woods. We're trying to find some magical medallions of some kind. Oh, Ace Bright Attack. Uh, sorry, gonna be in and out, working on stuff. No problem. Appreciate the support, as always. I missed Rin. Yeah, she was she was only here for about 20 minutes or, go, or so. She bopped in to say hi, and then she I think she ran off to sleep. Face hugger, I see you lurking there. You stay away. I see that shadow of the face hugger. It's just it's just lying and waiting. You didn't fool me, face hugger. Not today. I hate those things so much. <laughs> Whoa. What? I missed the medallion. We have to go back. I didn't know that was the exit. 
Maybe I should have known. Okay, now I leave for ice cream. Be back soon. All right, Chris. Ah! It grabbed me. The zone exit grabbed me. And it's like, come back to the island. I'm like, no! No, I don't want to go back to the island. There we go. Back to the east side. <laughs> Gosh. I feel like I've, I've had to go back and forth between the east side and the island more often than I would like. No! Don't you knock me back onto the island, dog. I have no desire to go back there. Not yet, anyway. Uh-oh. I see you, face hugger. I see you up to no good. Trying to start trouble in my neighborhood. It's no problem, because I'm not getting scared. Ah! Okay, I just got scared a little bit. <laughs> just a little. <laughs> Let's see. Have I been up here? Oh, yeah, I've been there. I've been there. I have seen the demon dogs before. You got in one little fight. <laughs> got in one little fight, but I didn't get scared. I can't weave Cifero into this, though. But I did leave Tokyo. No! No! I didn't want to do that. Alright. Alright. Ice Whirlwind! Go! Whoa! Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No! Umi! Alright. I am missing something about either this room or somewhere else. has got to be here somewhere. But where? Oh. No, you stay away. You stay away, demon dog. 
All right. Oh, there's another one. I gotta get up there somehow. But where is where is the way? Yeah, he really liked me to get, go up there. So he can eat me. just swan dive off of here. I can't do that. Okay. Uh... Subtle Fresh Prince. <laughs> I tried my darndest. did the fr Fresh Prince of Bel-Air come out? It's probably out around this time, wasn't it? Whoa. Ha! He lost it. He lost his boomerang. No sympathy. I won't look it up because I am not old enough. Because I am old enough as it is. Oh, we're all thirty here. There's, there's no shame. No shame and no judgment. There is, a, there is a, a pupper though. Come here, blue. Come here. Come here. Come on. Yeah. She just burps, and it it, do, it does not smell pleasant. Uh, Blue, I love you, but might have to cut down on your treat intake. She's like, what? Treats? But I love treats. You can't take them away. <laughs> you can't take them away from me. Fresh paw prints. <laughs> oh. Well. Okay. She's like, you could give her the minty dog treats. I could. I probably should get some for her because her breath stinks right now. <laughs> All I've got is those milk bones. They're supposed to... uh to clean her teeth, uh, but they don't seem to do much for her breath. Uh, Zipper and Zoe have breath mints for the for cats. Do they help? I'm guessing they do. All right, I'm gonna quickly look up what I'm supposed to do here. One moment. Ah! Where is it? Where is my Chrome screen? There it is. Okay. Uh, where's my guide? Meanwhile, Umi's just floating in the air with a bandage on her head. Like, when are they going to revive me? <laughs> uh... Now 
we did that. We did the waterfall. Uh, east of the lake. From the entrance, head north and east until you reach a bridge. Jump in the water. And south. And swim south and east to get a chest containing a large gem. We did that. Look for a small dirt path heading east onto the next screen. Take the path and use Fu's green squall to... Oh, okay. That's why. That's why I didn't know what I was doing. I'm like, I know there's something to be done here. But what? I don't know. Yeah, we did it. <laughs> I knew it had to be here. Oh no. Why are there all these butterflies? And why do I have to ruthlessly murder all of them? Oh, they will kill me. Okay. I think we're okay. We got a large gem! Alright. Let's see. Uh, Zoe's help out... Oh. Oh! Okay, I'm gonna pause. <laughs> that could have been really bad. Uh, Zoe... Zoe's helps out a lot. The vet says she has no tartar and she is almost 10. Zipper has barely any tartar. Okay. Whoa, okay. Settle down. Whoa, okay. Settle down. Settle down, Minotaur guys. Okay. Took care of those guys. They won't be bothering us again. So, okay, there we go. There's our secret path. Uh, let's see, where, oh, more demon dogs. No, you stay away from me, demon dog. hit me. Oh, it's the giant bush. The giant bush tree! Got it. Alright, well then I'm going to use the one I've got. Do. No, we will listen to those here in a second. Umi has been revived! Yay! all of the large gems. We're rich. We have 532 gems. What are we ever going to spend that on? Whoa, that's a demon dog.
I feel like there needs to be a way across here. Maybe not. Boo, please heal us. We're gonna die. Oh. It was- Oh, goodness! Whoa, what? Alright, well, that happened. Foo, we are injured. No, 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 I don't want to go that way. No. Well, I don't know what to do because I can't. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, mistakes have been made. Alright, I think we're... I, uh, maybe we're back on track. Maybe. I think we are. I think we're on track. Whoa, get away from me, face hugger. Oh, two face huggers. This is a problem. Whoa, three. Is in the cave. There it is. We found the sunrise medallion. Success. I still don't know how to escape this. Um... Not that way, clearly. Okay. So there must be another way. That is not the way. Hmm. 
Can't go that way. What's our, what does our trusty guide have to say about this? Use the escape gem. Do we have such a thing? I hope so, because I don't know about it. Um, yeah, about that escape gem. I don't think I have it. <laughs> Let's see. How do you get such an item? <laughs> I better not need that to escape. <laughs> Head back north. Let's see. Uh. Oh, is there something maybe in the cave that's going to help me escape? Let's find out. Is there something here to help me escape? There is not. Okay, well... Yeah, about that escape gem, I don't think it exists. Take the waterfall this way. Aha! I have escaped. No escape gem necessary. Ah! Run away! <laughs> Run away! The demon dogs are after me! Sorry, I'm quiet. I am out. Of no problem, Sprite Attack. It's not a problem at all. You, you said you were working on something, so not not an issue. I appreciate the support, regardless. Uh, Umi, don't run off the ladder. And then the island exploded. <laughs> Seemingly. <sighs> Apparently we've got a boss fight. Stay sharp, girls. Something's up. Correct. This isn't an island at all. It's the back of a monster. Say what? <laughs> Nero found the monster! What? Nero, what are you doing up there? Hold on, Nero. We'll save you. Alright. Okay, first, I'm gonna... S oh, I can't save. Uh-oh. He looks... Oh. He kind of looks harmless. He just looks like, the gi the, like a giant turtle. Whoa. It does seem to bite a little bit. Maybe a snapping turtle. Ah! 
Ah! This really isn't that hard of a fight. Something tells me there's more to this. Or... We killed it! We killed the turtle! Hold it, everyone. It looks like he's crying! Crying? You mean the monster? I didn't think monsters had feelings. Didn't you learn anything from poor Jiminy? You beat up the big baby! It certainly does look sad. Perhaps it doesn't want to hurt us after all. Of course, that explains it. I have no idea what just happened. What happened? Somebody explain it to me. <laughs> Excuse me, but I'm having a difficult time following you. What explains it? Thank you, Fu. I don't understand either. With Makona's help, I was able to understand the beast's thoughts. He said that while he was in hibernation, huge amounts of silt built up on his back. And that explains what, exactly? <laughs> he was still terrorizing the villagers. Makona is talking to the baby. <laughs> Don't you see? He was just trying to shake the dirt off his back. Gross, and it wasn't that obvious. So, <laughs> all along, the poor thing never intended to hurt anyone. What a terrible misunderstanding. I got Wi-Fi! Yay! Wi-Fi is the best thing ever. I don't necessarily understand why Fu powered up there. It seemed like a, a Hikaru moment to me, but... I'm not going to question it. G Deegs just beat up a, tur a big turtle baby and it started crying. Oh no, why do you do that? I don't know, everyone told me to defeat it. Umi, Fu, the giant turtle said he's going to take us up to the Sky Garden. Hikaru, it's a spirit beast, isn't it? That's what the villagers have been calling it. Turtle, spirit beast, what's the difference? He's taking us where we need to go, isn't he? <laughs> but the beast only submits to magic knights. That means you must be... them. Well, didn't Nero say that earlier? I'm pretty sure Nero acknowledged us as the magic knights earlier. Uh, be careful up there. Tell everyone goodbye for us, Nero. And thank your parents for showing us such a kind for uh, for showing us such kind hospitality. But most of all, listen to your parents, kiddo. See you later, Magic Knights. I can't wait to guest star as a screaming idiot on one of your all streams. It uh from Chris uh from Spread Attack. It should be fun. I am itching to play more Overwatch. Me too. That was a lot of fun last night. Thanks for the after-school message, Umi. <laughs> the FCC requirements are leaking into our video games. The Flying Turtle! Uh, yeah, Chris recruited Devin and the other Chris. Yep, not even going to question it. Just a Flying Turtle. No big deal. When did this become Aladdin in the 40 Thieves? 
I have no idea. I, I have not been questioning much of this game. I've just been accepting what it what it is uh, afforded me. <laughs> Hikaru confirmed again today that she is a great leader. Using Mokona, she communicated with the giant turtle in the lake and convinced it to fly us to the Sky Garden. I should be jealous, but I'm not. Maybe I'm growing up. I don't know. I still have my concerns about Hikaru, but that's just me. The beast in the lake looks like a huge turtle with wing-like flaps on the sides. Hikaru managed to communicate with it well enough to convince it to fly us to the Sky Garden. It was quite an impressive conversation to behold. <laughs> sure. It turns out that the giant turtle in the lake wasn't evil at all. It just wanted to wash all the sediment off its back. I can't really blame it. The best part about this encounter is the fact that the giant turtle agreed to take us to the sky garden on its back. <laughs> we flew with the turtle. Turtle is water flying type. That would be the coolest Pokemon ever, says Chris. <laughs> Long ago, the people who first settled on this island created a village. Because of its stunning beauty, the village came to be known as the Sky Garden. We who live here call it simply... Oh, goodness. Uh... Ayori, uh... Uh, bleh, I, that place. We'll just call it that place, which means breathless. Okay. I'm just gonna keep calling it the Sky Garden. <laughs> I can't pronounce that. Um, they say our ancestors first came here by riding the backs of spirit beasts, like that turtle. It just makes me wonder if anyone, if there's anyone who looks like me in the underworld. Nah, that's just silly dreaming. Now, isn't it? <laughs> uh, like a squirtle that learns hydro pump and uses it like a helicopter. Yes. <laughs> oh, I would pay to see that spread attack. Uh, they preach to us about this great great statue here but I've never seen it then again getting through the labyrinth of clouds isn't exactly child's play I have a feeling we're gonna be seeing that very soon the mayor of the sky garden is probably the most stubborn man alive if you're gonna go see him you better be readily aware of that well I better get ready Let's see. We could have you look like someone from the underworld right now with a fish slap. <laughs> have you heard? Rumor has it the legendary spirit beast of Lake the Lukido has has awakened. That means it may be possible for us to travel to and from the underworld below. I hear that the men down there are twice as handsome, too. woo -hoo. Let's see uh, from Chris. Y'all, I made it to 40 followers today. Awesome, Chris. Great job. You're 10 away from emotes. Happy to help, Chris. Though I didn't do much at all. It, it's all on you. Uh, it's sad that the princess uh, prays every single day for our happiness here in Sifra. Or it's said that the princess... Uh, what I want to know is, who's praying for the princess's happiness? That is a good question. Hmm. The emotes! Hello, are you new here too? Strangely, we've been having a lot of visitors lately. Really? I would have figured we were the first ones to arrive. First, that strange couple, then that big strong man. It's all become quite worrisome circumstance for me to deal with. 
That strange couple and that strong man. Okay. I don't know who they are. I'm sure we'll find out. The guy who lives in that outrageously large house is the mayor of the Sky Garden. He's really the village chief, but his arrogantness prefers the title mayor. <laughs> they call this place the Sky Garden. Yes, we know that. Don't you think that's weird? Um, it's in the sky. Uh, we already have a name for this village. Well, it's because nobody can pronounce that. Like, I certainly cannot. Uh, why not just call it uh, the Sky Garden? <laughs> Grown-ups make no sense. Because nobody wants to call it that. Sky Garden is much easier. Oh, this guy looks familiar. Well, well. What a surprise. Rafarga! I have been pursuing Emerald as well. My quest to save the princess led me here. Do you mean that Zagat's goons are here in the Sky Garden? Mm-hmm. That certainly is a troublesome bit of information. We'd better watch our, our step. You know, this place has a lot of history behind it. My great-grandfather built it. Sadly, though, it's been dead lately. There's no travelers from below. So, there are no, no customers, Saw. I do have to wonder how the economy functions up here. If they're in this isolated... Um city. Yuck! Look at those dirty clothes. What have we got here? It looks like a broom, a bucket, and a dust cloth. Let's see, we went in there already. Um... Oh. I thought I was going to sneeze there for a second. <laughs> And I dropped my controller. You know, this place is... Uh, okay, we, we already read. He has no more... No more dialogue. Let's see. I'm so excited for the emotes, says Chris. I really like the art in this game. It, it does have good art. Um, they took a lot of the cutscenes from the anime. Uh, which is causing me problems on the upload to YouTube right now. But, um, other than that, I, I mean, I do like the art of this. I mean, I, I'm guessing for the most part they're replicating the anime and the manga. But, uh, it's, it's, it's a, it's a well-made game. Even if it's not maybe the greatest game in the world. Uh, they, it's, it, the presentation is good. Uh, why'd you dirt, uh, why'd you dirty Underworld... People have to come here and disrupt our peace. Oh, thanks. Hello to you, too. Ew, don't touch me. Get away from me, you filthy urchins. Okay, well, you go do whatever it is you do. We're going to be over here. That actually might be more topical than I, I'm giving it credit for, but I'm, I don't want to really delve into that too much. Uh, there are people who use magic to fly here, and people who ride on the backs of spirit beasts. I'm not surprised at all that you came from the underworld. You probably just use magic. Uh, something like that. It's a little, a little disconcerting that you keep saying we're from the underworld. We're not dead. We're very much alive. I live alone in loneliness. Nobody else. Just me. Alone. I've tried those dating services you hear about, but none of them worked out. Yep, just me and my ch... Oh, gosh. Darn it. <laughs> Ha 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 ha. 
I was wondering when we were going to get one of these dialogues. <laughs> uh. Alright. Uh, j yep. Just me and my chapped hand. I really need a hobby. <laughs> uh. Okay. Moving on. <laughs> Whoa. There is a lot of kids here. We're all sisters, but I'm the prettiest. <laughs> all these kids running around is making me dizzy. I need a vacation. Okay. I see green hair and pink hair. And then just one redhead. I guess that I guess that makes genetic sense. Uh, I live around the corner. I love coming here. Oh, okay. So you're not from you. You don't live here. You just visiting. Huh? How many? Oh, who am, who the heck knows? I lost count somewhere around seven or eight. <laughs> Spread it. <attack. laughs> This spread attack is like chapped hand. Ew. It's a statue of a beautiful woman with wild hair. Neat. <laughs> Wait a sec. She has wild hair in her pits, too. This culture is disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the the dialogue. The, this game is worth playing just for the di just for the written dialogue. Beyond the door lies the labyrinth of the clouds, and behind that, the great statue. The great statue is the protector of the sky garden, but none of us have ever ever get to go see it. Don't body shame Umi for shame. <laughs> shame on you, Umi. Uh, the only way to get the visit. To get to visit is to get permission from the mayor. All right. Blue is lurking right now. It's like, pay attention to me, not to the light box. It's too nice outside to be cramped up indoors. Besides, I can get a great tan out here. It won't open the gates closed pretty securely. Labyrinth of the Clouds. No trespassing. Pa bleh. No trespassing. This place scares me. See, we talked to you yet? It's not fair. I'm living in a floating city and I'm petrified of ice. <laughs> I'm leaving. I can't take it anymore. I gotta get out of here. Oh no. I just remembered. There is no way out of here. Well, there is a flying turtle, if you want to take that. Have you noticed anything strange about the air? It's hard to explain, but there's a strange denseness to the atmosphere as of late. I don't know about you, but I think it's a sign of something evil about to happen, or it's, it might be about to rain. Where is the mayor? We must find the mayor. First, I want to talk to you. Hello, are you new here too? Oh, we already talked to you. Okay. Hmm. Oh, we've been in here already too. So, where is the mayor? Talk to Rafarga. Hmm. I think we've been in here as well. Yeah, we have. I think we've been in. Oh, that would creep me out. 
If I had like a glass floor like that, that would scare me to no, no end. Why is the sky blue? How come the sun is so hot? What's it like living in the underworld? I want to know. I want to know. I want to know! Because. And I will elaborate no further. Uh, my son asks more questions than anyone I've ever met. It's driving me mad. What's worse? I don't know the answers to most of them. Oh, I need some aspirin. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I'm gonna save while I'm thinking about it. <laughs> That's to help me figure out where to go, but he charges too much for that. Where is the mayor? Let's see. Okay, we've gone in there. What about this way? We go down and up. I think the mayor is in here. Yeah, in this big fancy building. Yep, here he is. I can tell already, this is the mayor. So what's the objective right now? We need to get the mayor to let us into the uh, the sky labyrinth. I'm the mayor. I called it. I knew that was the mayor. I'm the mayor of this beautiful sky garden. If I'm ever so proud of the great statue, I'm ever so proud of the great statue that watches over uh, the sky garden, protects us from evil. Eh? You wish to see the great statue, the symbol of our blessed land. Well, forget it, I tell you. The statue is the most sacred of all treasures here. Only I can see it, because I am selfish. <laughs> the unclean outsiders are not to gaze upon it. You'll never get the key to Heaven's Labyrinth so from me, so just forget about it. Hans! Hans, that's his name. Well, what a jerk. What a rude ma weirdo mare. Yes. Well, I suppose we can't do anything more today. Let's get some rest and try again tomorrow. All right. Well, I guess we are going to the hotel that gets no visitors ever. Yep, yep, this, uh... What? Really? You're from the underworld? Oh my, can I interest you in a room? Yes. Splendid. Three girls and one, um, puffy white thing. Follow me. <laughs> Makone. <laughs> Poor Makone. Oh, was that... Was that it? Do we not actually, like sleep there okay not gonna question it <laughs> to try the lake to try the lake over the world <laughs> or try to take over the world sorry I, I read that as try to lake over the world I'm like what <laughs> That's a T and not an L.
What do you have to say? The key to the door that guards the great statue has been stolen! Who could have done such a horrible thing? I could use a desk like this for studying, especially with finals week coming up. Um, if we ever get home, that is. <laughs> Try to lake over the world. <laughs> it does not make sense at all. I thought I should have known better, but I didn't. And I, re I read exactly what was in my head. <laughs> the aquatic agenda, says Chris. Uh oh. We're security guards of the mayor's mansion. There was a security leak last night, so now we gotta work double shifts. Well. They don't seem to be too concerned with us just kind of walking around out here. Oh, I remember this part. I think I remember this part. Oh, that's a fireplace. This is where the incident happened last night. I hope they don't punish me for this. <laughs> We're security guards of the mayor's mansion. Okay. They all say pretty much the exact same thing. Alright. I have successfully lost Hikaru and Umi. They are lost in the mansion. Never to be seen again. <laughs> Hikaru has no idea what is going on right now. <laughs> Did I say that? Did I, like, mispronounce my words? Ah! We need a team of four and Dead by Daylight. Actually, we need five. And then we can do uh, Kill Your Friends. No! The key to Heaven's Labyrinth stolen! I was so very careful to lock up the room where the key was hidden. So there was a robbery in a secure room. Is that what you're getting at? Suspense. Suspicious. You three are way too suspicious. Hans! <laughs> the cat ears of Hikaru. <laughs> Oh, we're getting thrown in the dungeon. That jerk. Well, we got thrown in the dungeon. They took Mayhem out of the arcade for the week. Sad day. Blizzard taketh and Blizzard... Or Blizzard... Ugh. Blizzard giveth and bl Blizzard taketh away. This is nuts. 
I don't care how badly we want that key. We wouldn't steal the thing. There's only one way to get out of this. We gotta find the real thief. That's fine and dandy, but how are we supposed to get out of here? This lock is fairly primitive. I think I may be able to persuade it to release its grip. Foo, the real MVP! That was amazing! Nice work, Foo. Thanks, but shh. Let's leave here quickly before someone finds us. Let me save. Whoa. Okay, well that's weird. Apparently we were back in lay. Let's see. Stealth! Whoa! Use all of the stealth. I am so stealthy. Ah! I've been caught! We might still get mayhem again on the daily this week. But yeah, a week worth of mayhem. It was it was so great. really think this pitiful lock is going to hold any better this time? <laughs> you have magic! Use it! <laughs> Even easier than before. Let's go. <laughs> they just really wanted a stealth section to this game. And <laughs> as Fu gets caught. Whoa, get out of the way. Oh, hello. Oh, what? Seriously, what happened? Can I not escape? Oh. Let us out. We didn't steal the key. If we did, we would have it right now. I like when they get captured. Foo is l like, this is fine. <laughs> Hikaru is the cat ears. Yeah. I like how her braid becomes like a cat tail, too. And Umi is like WTF. See if we can go this way. Whoa. What about this way? Clearly we couldn't escape the other way. I don't like the way this is going.
Ah! Oh, hello. We're gonna hide in this corner and hope for the best. <laughs> don't see me. You don't see me. Ha ha ha, you didn't see me. We safe? Not just yet. Line of sight, y'all. Ah! Oh, gosh darn it. We got so far. And we tried so hard. But in the end, it didn't even matter because we got thrown back in the dungeon. <sighs> Jump scare! <laughs> this game has it all. It has laughs, it has tears, it has jump scares. 10 out of 10, best game ever. <laughs> Table flip from spread attack. <laughs> she disapproves of my approval of this game. <laughs> Don't go that way. Okay, I shouldn't have done that, but oh well. Made it! Who just comes zooming in there? <laughs> Don't see me. Yes. Timed it. Gosh darn it. <laughs> oh, I was so close. I thought I had a timing down. No. <sighs> oh, this is mildly infuriating. <laughs> Foo, do your magic on the lock again, please. <laughs> what about instead of going up, you follow the other dude and duck in between the spaces? I might, I, I should probably do that. Hmm. 
Nope. <laughs> Jeff, just ignore Hikaru. Whoa! Okay, we got lucky there. I forgot about that guy. <laughs> Well, Foo, we've lost Foo and Hikaru. Nope. Sudden Hikaru. The pathfinding of the of our friends. All right. Let's try this again. Third time's the charm. Speed dash! We made it! Somebody yanked the painting off the wall. I wonder if the key was in there. There's nothing with investigating here. Looks like an ordinary bookshelf to me. I'd like to check out the stuff on the top of this chest, but it's too high for me to reach. And no, it's not because my legs are too short, okay? The fourth wall! We have broken the fourth wall! <laughs> what about... Uh, yes, go up the chimney. <laughs> Yo, bartender, give me the usual. Sorry, I've always wanted to say that. <laughs> Sob. Let's see. This fireplace is huge, but there doesn't seem to be anything special here. This book looks untouched. I doubt there are any clues here. Well, there's got to be something. I mean, why did we come this way? Unless it was all for naught. This cupboard is very tall. It doesn't seem to be anything special here. Oh. I really hope we didn't go through all this trouble for nothing. This is it's a potted plant that looks like it could use a drink. Poor thing. No, don't let the potted plant die. Alright. Uh Okay. Apparently... Hmm, it's kind of dark in here. Hard to tell if there are any clues here or not. Wait a minute! So, I think what the game is saying is that Umi is not smart enough to discover something, but Fu obviously is. Hikaru, Umi, ch come check this out! There's some footprints in here. In the fireplace ashes. I wonder whose they are. It's Santa Claus! Foo is MVP! <laughs> I, obviously the break-in is from Santa Claus. <laughs> What's going on here? Footprints in the fireplace? Doesn't anyone else find that weird? I've got it. Someone must have come down the chimney and taken their shoes... 
taken off their shoes before entering the room. Santa Claus! Aha! That's the way... That way, they wouldn't leave any sooty fr uh, footprints on the floor. Exactly. But their mistake was that they left tracks here in the fireplace. This is a good start. But there are more clues waiting. Let's climb up the chimney and look around. What? I don't want to get covered in ash. You know how hard it is to get soot out of your hair. <laughs> Santa is a thief. No. We believed in you, Santa. Your locks are going to have to suffer, Umi. There's no other way. Honestly, Hikaru. You are so bossy sometimes. Up the chimney we go. I'm actually impressed that they're able to do that. Look, there's something over there. Oh, it's a flute. That, that's Furio's flute. This is getting stranger by the minute. Come on, we better go talk to Furio and get to the bottom of this. As Hikaru just runs into a wall. So I don't know where Furio is. But I guess we're going to find him. Not that way, though. Where is Furio? Not over there. Let's see. I'm cheating again. I'm looking at our... Uh... Uh... I didn't find Furio the last time. Miss a lot, didn't we? Uh, let's see. Hmm, I can't say I'm surprised about the key being stolen. Yes, thank, thank you, Rafaria. You're so helpful. Oh. I see a heart. Why can't I get it? Oh, we've been in here. Apparently Furio is somewhere. Furio is in our hearts. A spread attack. He's apparently around and I don't know where. Let's take another glance at this guide, because I don't know where Furio is. 
And apparently that's what we were finding. Um, uh, hmm. Oh, there they are. Found them. Don't you have anything better to do with yourselves than to bother us? Huh? Furio, your clothes. He's covered in filth. Uh, maybe it's just me, but I'd say this makes Furio a prime suspect, wouldn't you? Oh, Furio. Tell us the truth, Furio. Was it you who stole the key? Uh... Can't you see he's in no condition to be bothered by you urchins? Go away. Right, my darling Furio? Ah, what the heck are you doing? What? It's only natural for two people to kiss when they're in love. Oh, God. oh my God. Furio, wake up. You must be delusional. Oh, he's definitely under some type of spell. Come on, let's go. Oh, F Fur Furio always playing with Fu's emotions. What on earth is going on here? I wonder if it really was Furio who stole the key. Okay, I don't know what I still don't know what to do. Um. Oh, go talk to. Go talk to our good buddy. That lady looks like like a like a douche we all know. <laughs> yeah. I'm taking bets. Who does the chat think that think that woman is in the cloak? Whoever stole the key will most certainly show up at the gate sooner or later. So why don't you just hide out near the gate and wait for them? That's the best way for you to find out if your friend Furio is guilty or not. Good idea. Yeah, let's go wait by the gate and see what happens, okay, Fu? Er, um, alright. If we stand out in the open, we're gonna get be caught. We need to find a place to hide. Isn't this exciting? I feel like we're in some kind of detective movie. Umi. Fu's just silent. Oh, uh, sorry, Fu. Wah, oh no. Don't be silly. I'm not at all sensitive about this. Furio means nothing to me. <laughs> I don't think she's being truthful. Come on. That statue over there looks like a good hiding spot. Let's go. Ten minutes later. One hour later. Two hours later. <gasps> it is him! He stole the key! <laughs> well, open and shut case. Time to go throw him in jail. I don't believe this. How could Furio do such a terrible thing? Oh, Foo, I'm so sorry. All right, let's save. Oh, I like this music.
Well, this is certainly interesting. Can't go that way. Whoa. Busted right on in. Okay. Well, that happened. Got it. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm just kind of running all over the place, hoping for the best. Got him. Okay. That's a dead end, apparently. these windmills have something to do with something. Yeah, there we go. I figured it out. Wait a minute. I saw something over here. Can we get down there? Probably not. We did find a magic jewel. Uh, I'm going to give it to Hikaru. Okay, we can't go that way. But we got a magic jewel, so it was all worth it. have to keep doing that. Uh... 
Switch back to that to heal. Whoa, no, uh oh. No, evil birds. Hey, we found a rainbow amulet. I have not been finding any of them. Um, so I don't think we're going to get any special secrets, unfortunately, for this run. the stairwell. Go this way. I don't remember. We're gonna go this way again. Hey, Chris. Welcome back. All right. I'm gonna consult the guide so we don't run around too long because it's already 11:15. Oh, I love this. Okay, this dungeon is a pain according to the guide. So apparently we're supposed to go this way. I had it right the first time. Maybe. Uh... Maybe not. I think it's talking about going to the east side. We'll find out. Yeah, we're lost. We're lost in a sky dungeon with bottomless pits of death for everyone. Okay. Um... I don't know if this is going to take us where we need to go. If not, then I think we have to go back the way we were. Yeah, okay. Let's see. Okay, yeah, we... 
Yeah, we're at the start of the dungeon. Okay. So... Okay, we'll go this way. We'll go back up the stairs. And... We're gonna find our way out of this dungeon if it's the last thing we do. Oh, okay. We just brushed up against that thing and it disintegrated on us. Wait a minute. Do we wanna go up this way? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, I think we can. Maybe not. Nope, can't bust it. Cannot bust it. Go this way. Okay. We made it to an intersection. Okay. Uh... Okay, jump back and take the east exit. Go through the next area and shoot the black ball to start the northern platform moving. Uh, ride it and jump east to the northern exit. Blah, 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 blah. Get the magic jewel. Return to the previous room with moving platforms. Jump north and west to the block with the ogre with the boom. Okay, so I think I know what we did. Ah! We fell! Ah! And I'm dead. No! Nope. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah! There we go. Mistakes have been made. I don't know if I can make this jump. No, we did. We, we made it! We're alive! Okay. Um... Return to the previous room of the moving platforms. Jump north and west to the block with the ogre with the boomerang. Wait here for a slow moving platform that will require a running jump start to get. Ride it west to the western exit of the room, another running jump. In the next room, kill the pink birds and continue west. Okay. So, ah, okay. Well, that was, that was bad. <laughs> We're just gonna keep dying, just keep falling to our death. Jump back and take the east exit. All right. Um. Whoa. Ah. I'm going to attempt to find out where where I need to be. It may or may not work. We will see. Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna use a health potion. It might bite me in the in the back. But I want to kill that that guy. There we go. 
There we go. I think I think I know where we're going now. Maybe. <laughs> ah! Darn it. Heal everyone. Let's see. I'm so glad you guys got to see Freddy finally. I love seeing pets on stream. Oh, we need the gem. Yes, we got it. Okay. Freddy is good, doggo. Where, speaking of which, where is Blue? I bet you she is sleeping on the futon as we speak. <laughs> Karu, what happened? <laughs> Karu. <laughs> How did you get stuck over there, Hikaru? Blue! Uh-oh. That's a bad bird. Alright, one second. Blue! Come here, Blue. I don't know. She might show up. She might be like, nope. She... Oh, we got two birds. There we go. Yeah. No. Are you kidding me? That killed that killed Foo. We are in so much trouble now. Oh my goodness. All right. I'm done with you, bird. Clearly bird is not not amused. I do not like birds. These birds. The bird is not the word. Bird is OP. Oh, hello, buddy. You just... Oh, good. We got to help. Ah, and... Okay. Use the... First I'm going to save. Then I'm going to use the health potion. Uh-oh. No! Hey, we found an orange rainbow amulet.
All right. Oh, look at this. My, but this strange place. But this is a strange place to keep one of these mirrors. May I make a suggestion? Actually, never mind. <laughs> you are free to make any suggestion you want, Sprite Attack. <laughs> Foo, a new power is manifesting in itself in you. Con concentrate deeply to receive the gift. I grant you the magic power of protective wind. With this great power, you may float in midair beyond the reach of enemy attack. All right. Oh, perfect. Let me see where, where I'm at. All right, jump back on the moving block. Oh, we got the chest already. Well, except I fell. Yeah, that happened. Ooh, I like that. Can I float? I can float! <laughs> Hacks! <laughs> Alright. Um. Uh. Return to the H shape. Let's see. Leave the room to the west and jump back on the arrow shaped island, then use Foo's new spell and head south. Okay. That seems so obvious. <laughs> okay, we're at the H-shaped room. Um, uh, uh, continue the room that has two connected corridors. Take the southwest exit. Okay. This is a very long dungeon, clearly. Whoa. Hey, we found another rainbow amulet. All right, let's save. I hope I can heal. I can't. This is problematic. I need mana. Let's see. Uh, jump northwest for a chest, return to, and take the northeast exit. All right. As someone who works with IT, kind of, sort of, what do I do with old computer parts? Uh. Recycle. Um, you usually there's a place out there. Micro Center might actually be able to do it, um, but there's a lot of places out there that do tech recycling. Uh, Best Buy might be able to do it as well, um, or if there is like another like PC part tech place. Um, I have a place right really close by to me called uh, EPC um, that allows me to take stuff over there if I so choose and I think they recycle for free but uh, there's a lot of places like that there might actually be some like businesses as well that do tech recycling every so often uh, if you check like Craigslist or something they might be able to tell you whoa I want to heal Purple rainbow amulet. Okay. What now? What do we what do we do next?
Return to the H shaped room. Okay. I'm guessing we we are going to this path now. We've explored all of the paths. At least we got some catchy tunes. Um, take the south stairs and head west. It says, tread not on the beauty below. Uh-oh. Well, I found a heart jewel. I'm guessing they don't want me to walk on the flowers, so I'm not going to do that. Um... Umi does the most damage. She gets the heart container. Oh! Dang it. Well, I think we ruined something. I hope I, hope I didn't mess something up by doing that. save. Okay, can't go that way. I don't know. Can we go that way? Maybe. Bueller. Um... If you step on the flowers, be careful not to step on the flowers, you get a heart jewel. Okay. Leave the room and come back and try again. Okay. So we, we did that already. Okay. Boss time. So the magic blights have finally arrived. It's about time. Furio, what is this all about? What's going on here? Ha 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 ha. He'll not answer your na naive please, little girls. Okay. We got a break. We got a break because there is a blue dog. Come here. Come here, you. Oh. The blue has shown her face. She is awakened from her slumber. Yeah. He's like, what you doing? <laughs> oh, Cold K! We have a raid! Welcome everyone. We're, we're taking a quick break for the doggo Before a boss fight Yep, this is blue So we are playing Magic Knight Ray Earth for everybody that's just joining um, We are playing on original Saturn hardware uh, No emulation here um, Oh Okay, Blue's like, I'm done. <laughs> uh, Magic Knight Ray Earth is based upon an anime and a manga. So we're, ha we're having fun uh, picking it apart because apparently it differs quite significantly from the uh, source material. So, uh, we were talking... Were, uh, were we talking to you, Scroat Butt Out? <laughs> yeah, this game has a really funny dialogue, too. Ah, so. uh, yes. The one with the colorful terms I have not heard. Watch your manners, little one. Furio, please answer us. Can you hear me? What has she done? Save your sweet breath. 
I'm sorry, screw up. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> I don't know why they use these terms. <laughs> Save your sweet breath. He's all mine now. His ears hear only my voice, and he obeys only my commands. <laughs> what are you talking about? That's impossible. Perhaps you'd respond more favorably to a demonstration. I'm more than happy to oblige. Furio, my sweet darling, be a dear and dispatch the girl in the green clothing. What? <laughs> Oh, cutscene. What? Who are you? Refarga! It's Refarga! your escudo weapons in exchange for this filthy waif. You win. Huh. That's more like it. I don't like your manner, witch. Who are you? There's honor only in a fair fight. That's it! You're under mind control from Zygot! <gasps> Rebarga, you saved us! Pick up your weapons! Time to die. Oh no! It was mind control all along! Rafarga? Rafarga, what's wrong? Rafarga! He's beyond your reach, children. It appears he is under the command of Master Zagat. Oh no! Apparently this is not in the anime either. <laughs> but Zagat's mind control powers are nothing compared to my charm, Magic. Surrender or perish, Magic Knight, one of these. I can't believe this is happening. Rafarga, our enemy. No, it can't be true. If you won't come to me, I'll come to you. Stop it. Rafarga. Rafarga. Hikaru, it's me. Hikaru, please. You must remember. Hikaru. No, babe. Why? Rip. Bye bye, Rafarga. You! It was you, Alcione! Aferio is like nap time. Well, we didn't even have to fight. Oh dear. You figured it out. Whatever shall I do now? You were, you were controlling Furio as well, weren't you? How could you do such a thing? Better yet, why? Because it would have been delightful to watch you die in the most shameful way imaginable. Uh, right in front of the machine you've been searching for. Excuse me, we've already established this is a rune god. Uh, at the hand of your own friend. Ah, but we were... Be but we were interrupted now, weren't we? I should have known it was too good to be true. You sick psychotic. I'll never forgive you for this. Oh, Rafarga. Poor Rafarga. What? Oh, your high-diving friend? Don't worry. He's probably become one with some mountain already. 
This time you've gone too far, Alcione. You get flushed when you're angry. How perfectly delicious. Uh oh. It's a burb! Fight the burb! Whoa! Okay. Okay, I think I know what I have to do now. Whoa! Except for that. That hurt. One moment. We're gonna get the ice arrows and chats going crazy. Yo, how'd your stream go? Mine went well. I just hit 40 followers from Chris. Uh, Cold K says, congrats. Uh, some really funny RP to come out of the stream tonight. I cannot wait to highlight it from Cold K. Uh, Chris is like, I'll check it out in a bit. Beginning is slow, but later gets a lot better from Cold K. This burb! Oh, this burb. not like what's happening. The burb looks mad. Uh-oh. Heal! Oh, the, f the feathers hurt, too. Got it. We killed the burb! Why? Why can't I ever win? I'm not giving up. I will stop you three if it's the last thing I do. Okay. You must have your butt kicked regularly. I suppose we can do it for you. Furio's still quietly asleep. Hey! That's convenient. He just woke up. Where? Where am I? Oh, Furio! I, I'm so glad you're all right. What? Huh? Ahem. <laughs> Nap time is over. <laughs> and Fu is unable to contain herself. <laughs> they both turn away. <laughs> So you really don't remember anything at all. The last thing I remember is this strange lady walking over uh, walking over me. I'm so ashamed. Hear that? He didn't really like her, foo. <laughs> now kiss from spread attack. <laughs> today is National Nap Day. Did everybody get a nap in today? <laughs> kiss, Chris. Darn it. <laughs> What are you trying to say? Oh, right. Like you don't know. <laughs> I have nothing to hide. <laughs> enough play. You have a job to do. Clef is like, enough of your nonsense. Clef. Step forth to activate Winham. Our minds are now as one. Our hearts as pure as light. I am Windham, and I am, and I am Fu. We fight as one. You will grow to become the true Magic Knights. It has been foretold.
<laughs> Let's see. This ship is taking too long as a spread attack. It's Windham! <laughs> come on, come on, mother effer! <laughs> of Rafarga. His will was much stronger than we had anticipated. How do you wish to address this situation, dear lord? Equip your armor and go, Inova. I pray you do not fail. Oh, uh-oh. The gods had enough. He said to Inova. I shall do exactly as you desire. Well, I'm off. Sorry, I've been such a burden. I'll make it up to you someday. Oh, Furio. Later. Oh. Rafarga, you're alive, aren't you? Alcione said that he had been brainwashed, but... but <laughs> Spread attacks like kiss. Why are you rando riding off table flip from spread attack? When I called for him, he answered my cry. So it wasn't true. The brainwashing. You must still be alive, Rafarga. Hikaru. All right. Alright, I think that's going to return us to the Sky Garden. Or it's going to take us to the Whispering Woods. All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna save, and we're gonna we're gonna call it a few minutes early tonight. Um, we'll pick this back up on Friday. Uh, thank you to everybody that showed up tonight. Uh, thank you to Spread Attack. Thank you to Rin. Uh, thank you to Chris uh, who raided. And thank you to Cold K, who also raided. We had two raids in one night. That was awesome. Um, uh, I don't know how much further we are on this in this game. I think we're probably on the last third of it by now. But um, we should be getting close to the end pretty soon. Um, my intention is to beat this, and we'll move on to something else. Um, but as far as that goes, uh, have a great week. Uh, it is now, we're now in daylight savings time. Hopefully everything is warming up for everybody. But um, other than that, again, have a great week. Have a great night. And I will see you all on Friday. We're not going to do a raid either. So uh, just, just a heads up. We'll, we'll probably do one next time. Um, but yeah, I'll see you all on uh, Friday. Night, everyone.